Welcome back. This is an interesting one. The radius is 6. A, B is 6. What is the area of the shaded region? Try this one on your own. Hit the pause button and then we will do it together. Okay, I hope you tried it on your own. We're going to do it together now. So A, B equals 6 and the radius equals 6. So the first thing is you want to try to get the area of the whole circle. You know, the formula for the area of the circle is pi r squared equals the area of the circle. And since the radius is 6, pi times 6 squared is 36 pi. The radius is 6, and a to b is also 6. Uh, and since the radius is 6, the you can go from the origin of the circle to uh, the first point of that uh, line, and that would be 6. And then you can go again from the center of the circle to the other point in the line, and that would be 6 because the radius is 6. And now you see we have a triangle where all the sides are equal, 6, 6, 6, okay? Anytime you have a triangle with all equal sides, it's an equilateral triangle, and every angle is 60 degrees, okay? There's three angles. Uh, they all equal 180 degrees, and they're uh, all equal angles, so they have to be 60 degrees each. Now, what that means is we have a section of the circle with uh, that opens up to a 60-degree angle, and there is a uh, ratio where we can get the area of that section of the circle, okay? And that ratio is... The angle over 360 equals the area of that section divided by the area of the whole circle. So we have 60 degrees divided by 360 equals the area of the section divided by 36 pi, which is the area of the whole circle. And then we could simplify the 60 over 360 to 1 6. So we get 1 6 equals the area of the section over 36 pi. Then we cross multiply. We get 36 pi equals 6 times the area of the section, and then uh, divide each side by 6. So the area of that section is 6 pi, all right? Uh, and that makes sense because it's 1 sixth of the whole circle, and 1 sixth of 36 pi is 6 pi. Uh, to get the area of that shaded area, we now have to subtract the area of the section, which is 6 pi, by the area of the equilateral triangle. So we have to calculate the area of the equilateral triangle. There's a few ways to do this. Uh, you should just use that simple formula, which is the area of the equilateral triangle equals the square root of 3 divided by 4 times the side squared. So the side is 6, so we would have square root of 3 times 6 squared divided by 4 and that would then be square root of 3 times 36 divided by 4. Uh, we could simplify that. Uh, 4 goes into 36 9 times. So the area of the equilateral triangle is 9 times the square root of 3. To calculate the area of that shaded area, we would take the area of the circle section, uh, which is 6 pi, and we would then subtract it by the area of the equilateral triangle. So we would have 6 pi minus the area of the equilateral triangle, which is 9 square root of 3. And that would give us the answer. It would be 6 pi minus 9 root 3. And there you go. Please subscribe if you want to see more of these videos. I'll keep making them. Drills equals skills. Keep at it. Thanks so much.